On News Dan Marillo and News Channel 10 2, I'm Alan Robertson. Good morning, everybody. I'm Rhonda Lonert. And I'm Chuck Alicious, Chuck Williams. <laughs> Absolutely. We have a little bit of time before we get out of here again. Cannot thank each and every one of you enough for listening and viewing in on News Dan Marillo and News Channel 10 2. But with that, of course, we, we are in the month of June. And this is definitely one of my favorite months on a multitude of different, a multitude yes. of different reasons. <laughs> but part of that is June Dairy Month. We are joined down there in the Atlantic, Atlanta studio, pardon me, by Chef Will Coleman teaming up with America's Dairyland to create some legendary moments going through June Dairy Month. Chef Coleman, how are we doing today? Doing amazing. I also love June and I'm here to bring the party in all the ways, but especially for National Dairy Month. Absolutely, absolutely. Oh, you have you have the entire spread and everything here. So, oh, so we're not playing around. Oh yeah, so I can see that. Now, <laughs> it, it, see, I, I haven't been too curious. I, I've been curious when it comes to the idea of June Dairy Month. Talk to us. Talk to us a little bit more about this, this partnership with America's Dairyland. Absolutely. So National Dairy Month is all about celebrating the farmers and people behind the product. West Coffin cheese has been legendary, as you said, for many years. And the state economy is really being funded by over $46 billion uh, worth of dairy products the farmers are creating. And that's more than Idaho potatoes and Florida oranges combined. So that's a really big deal. Well, and they really emphasize, you know, sustainability, animal care, uh, farmer leadership. These guys really have it going on. But your, your job is to uh, provide us with some uh, crowd-pleasing recipes, am I right? Absolutely, you're so right. They are using innovative practices to care for the land animals, which really is the key to making amazing dairy and dishes. Like one of my favorites is this feta and Parmesan ice cream sandwich. It's Ooh. a great way to think about a classic such as ice cream sandwich, but in a more sweet and savory lens, because that's what Wisconsin dairy is all about, versatility. So this one features the Athena traditional feta and also the grated Stella Parmesan cheese. And classics like the Wisconsin dairy cream and the whole milk. This is a great way to get this party started this summer with a sweet and savory take on like ice cream sandwiches okay now i'm from the old school grilled cheese <laughs> you're keeping it classic yeah there you go grilled cheese uh how can i dress up my grilled cheese sandwich yeah, so when it comes to getting a great grilled cheese, you need amazing cheese products. So I recommend things like the Boar's Head Sharp West Constant Cheddar Cheese or a more light creamy cheese such as a burrata. But cheese, great cheese is the key, but you can do fun toppings like maybe bacon or tomatoes, um, maybe a BLT grilled cheese or a candy bacon grilled cheese, a pulled pork grilled cheese. The options are endless when it comes to grilled cheese, but at the end of the day, you need good cheese. <laughs> Chef, Chef Coleman, I'll be honest, I have not had my breakfast yet. I, I, <laughs> this, this, oh, I'm hungry. <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> it, 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 when it comes to the spread, there's mentioned you, you mentioned the ice cream sandwiches, but there also when it comes to the idea of cheese, you know, it, it's it's synonymous when it comes to pizzas, when it comes to burgers, when it comes to all, all the typical things that would come to cookouts mm -hmm. and barbecues, the whole nine yards when it comes to summertime. Talk to us a little bit more about so, some of those some of those recipes and some of those things that we can be I I anticipating when it comes to the summer months. Yeah, so summer months are all about gathering with your friends, hosting the parties. Love your friends that host the parties because they're going to be the best friends. And I see that everybody's having air fryers in the kitchen nowadays, which right. I love. So one appetizer I love to recommend is this air fried burrata cheese made with the Bill Joyoso burrata, but also paired as well with the Wisconsin Cheese Bros Fratello, which is a Asiago and Parmesan cheese blend. This is a great way just to highlight Wisconsin cheese through fun and interactive dishes like this one because you can serve a little crispy toast or crudite taste to dip in their spread and do all the things with the cheese that is amazing that is absolutely amazing do you just personally do you have a favorite cheese and and why is it your favorite yeah, I really love the jalapeno gouda from Marika because it's spicy, a little bit smoky, very creamy, and you can put it in things like a, a, a salad. Um, so right here we have this corn salad, which features um, the Mar Marika cheese, like I mentioned, that has a jalapeno in it, but also the Odyssey 2% Greek yogurt, which is a great way to amp up your protein, but also make a creamy, light salad dressing that goes perfectly for this salad, which you can serve with grilled meats and chicken. So I really love that, that gouda cheese because it's just a, such a fun take on a classic. 
and it's spicy like me. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I'm, I'm always a spice guy, always down for jalapenos, mm -hmm. and the, the list goes on and on and mm -hmm. things of that nature, of course. Chuck, you had a question? Yeah, but I'll tell you this. I'll never look at a glass of milk or cheese, and I, I got a new way of looking at it right now. But I'll tell you, the way I'm seeing it right now, uh, you're getting all you need inside of a slice of cheese, vitamins, minerals, yes, and everything else. Absolutely. And good flavor, right? Okay, yeah, all right. Yeah, I'll buy that. I'll buy that. <laughs> Now, now, we do have a little bit of time before we get out of Chef Coleman again. Thank you so much for, for, for joining us this morning. When, when it comes to, again, with, with, with the different ideas of, of dessert options, of entree options, there's also those who are, who are looking for some of the healthier options. You're, you're mentioning the salad just there. What are some other healthy options that we can incorporate cheese and, and, and solid alternatives to cheese? Yes. So when it comes to, you know, getting your cheese in, you have your salad options, but maybe you want things that are more grab and go as well. We have busy lives. So one thing I like to recommend is maybe this heirloom tomato tart that has a little bit of bacon and basil. You can use turkey bacon or pork bacon for this recipe. Very light um, and great way to do the summertime. And it really features that boar's head, sharp west constant cheddar cheese, which is one of my favorites for grilling and beyond. But when it comes to getting inspiration, you want to check out westconstantcheese.com because they have endless recipes for you to choose from from healthy to savory to decadent it's it's all there for you absolutely I, i've been the biggest cheese guy growing up my, my family definitely despises me still for it as far as infatuation <laughs> there's options cheese. for everybody though it's sweet it's for, savory it's, it's, light it's, creamy absolutely if there's ever a time to do it it's june dairy month you know what yes, i mean if there's yes. ever a time to do it it's definitely this time but again chef coleman thank you so much for for joining us this morning again your work with america's dairyland as we get ready for june dairy month again absolutely amazing spread i would definitely do my best to to take apart some of those recipes for for my house and for my cookouts of the summer yeah so check out that probably was cotton cheese badge whenever you're shopping nationwide to make sure you're getting the best of the best because we all deserve to eat this good right thank you for having me. we do thank you so much chef you have a great day now thank you I, I, I'm so hungry right now. Yeah, <laughs> I'll, be, yeah. I'll be honest. I am beyond hungry. <laughs> and, and, I mean, I wasn't too familiar with the idea of June Dairy Month, but I'm, the first thing that I'd seen when it came to ice cream sandwiches, that tripped me out I know. Right. entirely. You know? Yeah. Because I mean, cause, like when, when you have, um, and one of my favorite desserts, I love cheesecake personally, so I, the yes. process of putting that together and all that. And, mm -hmm. you know, it's just, I, I have so many different ideas that I want to bring in when it comes to the summer, when it comes to cookouts, when it comes to hanging out with friends. It, 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 it's definitely a great time. You know? Well, if you make those ice cream sandwiches, let me know how that goes. Oh, for sure. For I, sure. I'll tell you what, that. gang, I don't care what you say. I am your typical grilled cheese guy. Typical. Mm -hmm. My, are, are, we, are we going the, the regular like American singles or just like are, are, are we going the gourmet cheese, the style cheese, or what are we talking about? Well, I don't mind the gourmet cheese now. All that jalapeno, no, I don't do all that. But I'll tell you what, uh, I'm wondering, can you barbecue cheese? You know, like can, by, like just throw it down the grill, like by itself. Yeah. No, no, no. Like in a sandwich type deal for that smoky flavor. Oh, for sure. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. You know, uh, uh, we've, well, you've had it with burgers a couple of times. Yeah. I mean, I I'm not too familiar. This might be a little bit too ignorant on my part, but I would feel like there's some form of smoking when it comes to smoked Gouda, you know what I mean? Which is also yeah, amazing. That's, you know, yeah, I, I never I didn't think about that quick enough. That's all right. Okay. <laughs> but it's fine. But it's fine. So, so, so yeah, so, so I do have to ask. We have about maybe like 10 seconds or so, if that. Uh, like the go-to, actually, no, I think I think we're coming up on time anyway. So look, we begin. Cannot thank you guys enough for for joining in this morning. Uh, it's going to be a, a very very fun afternoon. High noon coming up tomorrow. The list goes on and on. But in the meantime, have a great day, fresh of your day. We'll see you tomorrow.